So welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we are going to be testing out the super hyped up product, the Estee Lauder uh, Double Wear Stay in Place Foundation. And so far, um, my first impressions of the product, we are going to find out right now as I demo it. So let's get started. Whew, I'm out of breath. I had to go run up there and get this foundation. So, whew. Anyways, so I'm excited to try this Estee Lauder Double Wear um, Stay in Place Makeup. And mine is in the color Shell. So this product has been really hyped up. I think, don't quote me if I'm wrong, but it's around $43 price range. And the foundation that I normally get is MAC at the 35 and I'm really happy with the MAC. And so it's going to take a lot for me to want to change foundations um, with this price point. So since it is cost more, since it does cost more than my normal foundation, it better be better. That's all I got to say. I can't get open. Okay, here we go. And then just like with the MAC, you have to buy a pump for this, which I did not. So hopefully this goes. It's supposed to be a full coverage matte foundation, which is my favorite finish and look, so let's see. Ooh, I don't have the pump, so hopefully I didn't get too much. Back in there. Oh yeah, I think I got too much. So the color is looking nice so far. I hope it doesn't oxidize or turn orange. That's a big no for me. So, so far this is pretty on par with the MAC foundation that I normally wear, but we'll see how it goes throughout the day. It does seem like it might actually have a little bit more coverage than the MAC foundation, which would make it worth it, but let's see if it lasts throughout the day or not. And if you hear my dogs barking and stuff, I'm sorry. So my first impression of this foundation is that I really like the color. I really like the finish so far. I feel like that it is really good coverage. It might even be better coverage than the MAC foundation that I normally use, which it better be because it costs more. Um, but I will check back in with you guys later today um, to see how this lasts throughout the day but so far I really like it and it's good so I'll let you guys know but if I have to give my thoughts on this foundation so far I will give a thumbs up I like it so it's been about six hours since I put on the foundation and I am not really seeing that much breakdown of the product and so I'm actually really impressed with it so far and it's holding up. So it's been about 12 hours now and as you can see I'm pretty shiny. I obviously need to put on some powder but besides that um, the foundation actually has held up like incredibly well honestly. Probably even better than my MAC foundation. And so I actually am really impressed and I must concede that the hype is worth it. I would definitely recommend this foundation, especially if you're going to be going out. The longevity is great. The finish is great. I mean, overall, I mean, I just really recommend. I'm about to take it off for the night. So last look. Pretty good. We're happy with it. And yeah, I would definitely... Recommend. And those were my final thoughts following the wear test. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed my review of this highly anticipated, hyped up Estee Lauder Double Wear Foundation. I was excited to try it. I think that I will probably continue to use it, um, obviously, until this is empty and will. I rebuy it, that is something we will see. So stay tuned um, for my more upcoming looks. Will I stick with my Holy Grail MAC foundation? Will I continue on to this? We will see. So thank you for watching and see you guys next time.